Hello everyone, I am Dr. Kalyani, Head of Physiotherapy and Critical Care at AIG Hospitals. As we all know, this pandemic COVID-19 is mainly affecting the respiratory system of our body, leading to complications such as pneumonia, breathlessness and other respiratory disorders. Today, Dr. Yogita, my colleague, would brief some of the breathing exercises that are helpful in mild, moderate and uh, suspected cases of COVID. Hello everyone, good afternoon. I'm Dr. Yogita, physical therapist from AIG Hospitals. Uh, today we are going to discuss few breathing exercises which will help you in relieving the breathlessness, reducing the breathlessness, preventing pneumonia and further hospitalization. Firstly, breathing is just inhale through the nose and slowly exhale through the mouth as you are whistling out. Just Put, that, uh, put the mouth in pouting uh, position and exhale it through the mouth. So first uh, I will demonstrate and then will repeat it again. Just inhale through the nose as far as possible. I'll repeat it again. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth as far as possible. That is your first exercise. Diaphragm is actually a primary inspiratory muscle. So you need to train that muscle a lot to prevent breathing issues. So in diaphragmatic breathing, you just put one hand on the abdomen and other hand on the chest. Inhale deeper so that your abdomen will bloat out and exhale through the mouth so that abdom your abdomen will sink in. You have to really pay attention during this exercise. So just look at me. I'll repeat it again. So the next exercise would be the balloon exercise. This is this will really helpful in the uh, this will be really helpful in the elderly individuals. So in with this, what you have to do is just blow out and then inhale through the nose. Blow out again in the balloon and inhale through the nose. Okay. So just look at me. So you have to blow out and inhale through the nose, blow out and inhale through the nose. Then other exercises, uh, water and straw. This is also similar to balloon exercise. You have to take some water in the glass and take a straw and then first blow out so that the bubbles will form and then inhale through the nose. And inhale. So this is your next exercise then so next exercise would be the spirometer this will really help you to uh, increase your lung capacities and your lung volumes so here we have 600 cc 900 cc and 1200 cc which will help you according to your lung capacity how much you are able to lift this will also encourage you by giving you visual feedback so how to do this is just put this mouthpiece inside your mouth and inhale deeper so that according to your capacity you'll be able to lift one or two balls. And exhale out. Just remove that mouthpiece and exhale out through the mouth. Okay, so this this is very important. You can just uh, you get it in any pharmacy store and use it to improve your lung capacities. 
So next exercise would be your uh, uh, breath holding exercise. You have to inhale for three seconds, hold for four seconds, and exhale for five seconds. Just look at me. I'll repeat it again. I hope you all understood these exercises and I would uh, suggest you to repeat these exercises three times a day and do for 10 repetitions each and uh, stay hydrated and stay safe. Thank you.